What's up, guys and gals? Versus Frogs here. Um, so we have another day, another Kawasaki 09 mod, and probably the most blatant forms of cheat of stealing that he's done before. Um, usually, it's just scans. Um, a very very old modder. Um, well, I don't know if his age is very old. He's just been in the RE modding community for like 21 years now. Enrico Marini, Andrew, um, actually claimed recently, I, which if he ever uh, has like a screenshot or something that I could see, then I'll be able to show that. But he claimed that uh, Kawasaki 09 took one of his skins went to the last page of the sheet, took off Andrew's name, like his signature, on his skin, and then put Kawasaki 09 over it. So, um, yeah, he's been doing really slimy stuff, but the two examples, I'm there's actually several examples in this uh, shitty-ass um, Gun Survivor mod of him completely just taking a room, copy and pasting it from the irregular mod. It's not like he just got an idea from it. It's not like something was similar. Um, like, I think I saw somebody play my Claire 2.0 mod, and they were like, oh, th this is just like um, the irregular mod because they got poisoned in the star's office. He had his poisoning set on the locker. I had mine set on the fax machine and then used that same factor multiple times in my mod later on because I actually learned how to do it. I didn't just copy and paste the dude's room into my mod like Kawasaki is doing. These are 100% just copy and paste and I'll show it. So the first example here is using um, the wrench which is just a reskinned other item. It's not actually an item itself. Um, behind the statue to get a red jewel. It's exactly the same, as you'll see. I think it's back here. You use the... Yeah, you use the wrench to get... Yep, behind the statue. Um, that's Kawasaki's first version. He put out another version of this shitty gun survivor mod, which basically just had a sped-up handgun and, like, two other very lazy updates that... You know, the mod's complete shit, and I'm surprised that people didn't shit all over it, because it's really just new skins, a couple of features, and then the best features of the mod are just things he copied and pasted. So anyways, this is the original, um, irregular mod, played by, uh, Bakba Soup, and here's how that one looked. So not all, not only did he have the event, did he just have it copied and pasted into the game, um, it was the exact same item with the exact same reskin, and then you get the exact same item afterwards. Because um, he actually stole another thing from the Irregular Mod 2 in his mod where in his uh, Nemesis mod where you walk up to the vending machines and trade a gem for random crap, and that was also the, in the irregular mod too. He at least had a different skin on it. Um, but anyways, there's another very blatant stolen thing that he did. So here's uh, Bakba Soup's playthrough of the Resident Evil 2 Nemesis mod first chapter. Um, which it ends in this exact, the exact same room as the irregular mod, but you also see it ends in the exact same camera angle as well, which is just indicative of a copy and paste of the room over. It's not like he, first off, he didn't credit the guy. I'll show the credits at the end. He did not credit this guy. I don't think anybody actually knows his name, but even if he just said, like, unknown Chinese modder or the guy that made a regular mod at least put like a half-assed effort towards crediting him that would be more um that would get more respect from modders that he at least named him or something but he just didn't credit him at all 
and I will show that. So anyways, here's how, here's his, since I did his version first, and then I did the irregular mods version the first time, I might as well just do that again. Here's how his shitty mod, that's just a copy and paste ends. He puts that in every mod he's ever made. Oh, by the way, uh, Bach is complaining because that was, uh, this was like the seventh mod in a row that he put the same fucking DMCA song that the streamers get pissed about every single fucking time and he doesn't give a fuck, so anyways. Uh, I didn't mean to skip that. <laughs> So as you see, um, it ended like sh very shortly before she got to the stairs. Um, in Kawasaki's shitty mod version, Nemesis mod first chapter. All right, so just for shits and giggles, let's see how the regular mod ends. <laughs> Oh, exact same camera angle, exact same spot. Interesting. So <laughs> it ended in the exact same camera angle in the exact same spot. <laughs> it's hilarious to me. It's really hilarious to me. Um... Which, it kind of does annoy me a little bit that these streamers aren't like, hey, I just, I mean, Bach played this, like, two months prior, so, hey, I remember seeing this exact same thing in this other mod, hmm, that's a bit sus, but, I mean, I'll give him a break on that, because he plays a whole lot of different mods and a whole lot of different stuff, the same thing with Wolf and Big Boss and stuff, but... You know, you'd think that they would remember, but maybe they just don't want to bring it up to not cause any controversy or something. Okay, so the last example that um, he did put a tiny little bit of a unique twist on it, I guess, because he reskinned the items to be different things, but the trade off for the items is at the same exact spot as the irregular mod, and he just changed the skins of the items that you change and then the items that you get. So it's another copy and paste and he put like a tiny little edit on it. So once again, I would argue that this is another copy and paste, but um, this is from, once again, the Nemesis mod, final chapter, shitty mod that he did. So here we go. The game sucks. <laughs> uh... Wait, so what's this gonna give? Wait, they're both the same vending machine. Oh, cool. Okay. And here's how it looked in the irregular mod. Uh, once again, Bakbatsu, like and sub to him. Slap that like button. Okay, here we go. Okay, I hope we can pull this off with no troubles. Uh, Green from blue. Alright, I'm killing these pieces of shit. Green from blue. Green from blue. Alright, we just went through blue. Now it's green time. Nothing else to really say about that. This is the reason why Kawasaki 09 needs to be stopped, and um, people will say, well, like uh, Resident Evil Nemesis 30 used on the DTS mod, people will say, well, you could just encrypt your mods now. Well, the thing that sucks about the mod encryptions and stuff is like I said, I looked at the irregular mod, I looked through the script and the coding, and I actually learned from it, and now I know where to like set, for example, poison 
anywhere I want and stuff like that. And I actually learned from it. I didn't just copy and paste with no credit like Kawasaki did. Um, so the mods all being encrypted kind of um, puts a hindrance to that. And then people can't really learn from each other anymore without like just straight up messaging each other. And then the other person has to go through the headache of trying to explain it to other person without them just directly seeing the scripting. And so it's not all um, sunshine and roses there just because it can be encrypted. So anyways, um, I said that I was going to show his credit list just to show that he did not credit um, the guy on his mod whatsoever. So this is his uh, credits for the gun survivor. Um, Resident Evil Nemesis 30. Ken Al Jwok, that's for skins. Juvenile, Martin, Team 96, Rob's Bio, Camizo, um, Hunter Beta 2. Nope. I mean, he didn't even put, um, he didn't even, like, like I said, I don't think anybody really knows the guy's name, but he could have at least put the maker of the irregular mod that I copied and pasted my roots from. Like, he could have at least put that half-ass of a credit, but he just didn't even credit him. So, that's bullshit, and it's really why he needs to be stopped. Um, and I don't exactly know how to do that, because streamers are getting shit-tons of views and stuff from his mods, so I don't think that they're going to stop playing it anytime soon. So, I was just showing that, and uh, yeah, this dude needs to be fucking stopped, and nothing else to really say. So... Very disappointing. Christmas frogs take it easy.